Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and decorate this tree. Christmas cookies. Hey friends, it's mid-July and that means it's time for my now annual Christmas in July video. So, time for my transformation. I just put on a Christmas sweater and I'm gonna try to keep it on for as long as possible, but I don't think that's gonna be very long because it was about 90 degrees yesterday. And I'm gonna be putting on my Mickey Mouse Christmas reindeer necklace. And of course, time for Christmas socks. I got Christmas socks last year for a present and they're the Ray Dunn fuzzy socks. It says cheer, joy, and peace. I think I'm gonna put on cheer because I'm already wearing all red. Time to put on all green. It's like opening a Christmas present. Yay! Oh, they say cheer right here on the foot. I thought it was gonna be around the ankle. Got the Christmas socks on. Okay, I'm gonna do my decorating montage now, and I'm most likely gonna be putting hip hop Christmas as the copyright free music behind this. If you've watched any other kind of Christmas videos on YouTube, you know hip hop Christmas. montage I already got very hot I already thought of a plan B beforehand and I found this red flannel oops so we're gonna continue with this for the rest of the video garage now and this is our cabinet where we keep just some of the Christmas decorations we have a few Halloween and then Christmas and then we have Easter but I'll go ahead and take some of these also check this out we have some fake gifts that we put underneath the tree we kind of do it like props just because like literally just because but isn't that so cool I'm gonna put that underneath the tree and it's gonna make it look like a real Christmas tree Here's one of the mother loads for our ornaments. I think I'm just gonna make it simple. White and red Christmas, or white, red, green. I don't know, we'll see. I grabbed a couple of Christmas decorations from the garage. We have the gifts, the bows, ornaments, and a wreath, and some miscellaneous things. So let's get decorating. I said in the past that this is the first year we're deciding to keep up our tree all year round because we wanna do it for the different seasons. This has been up since spring and we have not decorated for the summer yet. We're gonna go ahead and skip summer. We're gonna skip fall. We're gonna go to Christmas now. Halloween is actually my favorite holiday. September, I just can't wait. finally took off a majority of the decorations. I decided to keep these on because kind of Christmassy. That's kind of stuck to the top, so just don't look at that. But my decoration skills aren't the best. I'm really just going to throw the Christmas decorations onto the tree and hope for the best.
Now I think I finished the bulk of the Christmas decorations. It is like the Christmas tree. And I think all I need to do is light it up. <gasps> Yay! This thing lights up too, but I have to keep continuing to press the button. I don't know how to keep it on, but look at that. Oh, let me turn off the light. Okay, turn off the lights in the kitchen so you could see the glory of the Christmas tree. Alright, now we're going to be making some Christmas cookies. But we do have a bunch of these Pillsbury pre-made cookies. We've had this since last year because you know these are really hard to find once it becomes Halloween. And we also have this regular pumpkin cookie dough one. We're going to try to make this Christmassy. I'm going to see if I have sprinkles. I have a little bit of red sprinkles, almost nothing. And then I have this new jar of sprinkles, multicolored chocolate. Okay, we're making cookies. I don't actually think we make Christmas cookies during Christmas. We mostly do cookies during Halloween. As you see, we're really big Halloween people. And my favorite thing is to watch Halloween movies and then eat these cookies after we bake them. Um, there we go. Actually, I think I should preheat this. Totally forgot. I'm not sure how long I keep that preheated. Read the instructions, actually. Me. Okay, while that's preheating, let me tell you my Christmas recommendations for shows and movies. For Nickelodeon, I absolutely love the Danny Phantom, the Spongebob first Christmas episode, and one more. Hey Arnold! So those I absolutely recommend. And then for Disney, I always have to watch The Ultimate Christmas Present, that really old movie with Brenda Song. How the Grinch Stole Christmas, of course. What else? Well, Harry Potter, the first movie, kind of a Christmas movie, kind of a Halloween movie also. Once it's Christmas, I cannot stop listening to Christmas music. It's kind of like, I have to. I have to feel in the mood. I have my own Christmas playlist. Merry Christmas by Salem Elise. Baby, I'm Coming Home by Ali Brooke. Naughty List by Liam Payne and Dixie. Sorry, I just love that one for some reason. Let me listen to it. Let me get in the mood. I mean, I expected a perfect cookie. Okay, let's try to fix this. The good news is that it was not stuck to the pan at all. Yay for vegetable oil. But here's the reveal. That's pure black on the bottom. Christmas cookies. I'm gonna open up my new sprinkles and try to decorate the cookies. You just, you just know how this is gonna go already. We have a bunch of these happy birthday signs and this is what you get on cupcakes at the grocery store but we save them so we have some Christmas rings. <laughs> uh, now we're gonna make some hot cocoa. I've been really digging hot cocoa lately. Um, obviously the Swiss Miss. I did buy some Ready Whip so I could do some good decorating. Hold up. I just remembered that I have this red peppermint flavored whipped cream. I think this would be a lot better. <laughs> Do you think Santa would want any of this? I honestly think not, but he should be grateful that I'm leaving this out for him anyway. Okay, I'm gonna attempt to make the cookies look a bit more presentable. I'm just gonna take off all of the burnt part because I plan to make like a TikTok. All right, I just finished filming my last piece of my Christmas in July TikTok, and now I don't know if there's anything left to do. I think we have officially accomplished Christmas in July for this year. 